My name is Elizabeth Reeser, and I play PJ Lane in Bonnie and Clyde. Like the new do, and I was fond of your performance. Can't seen your ball on a while, PJ. Yeah, well, things are tough all over. Well, PJ Lane is a female journalist in the 1930s, and in Texas, of all places. PJ's well-educated, so she obviously came from a, a wealthy to-do family and on the East Coast and has somehow decided she was gonna live this life alone and go be a journalist and to be a single woman alone in Texas, be a crime reporter, was just very unusual. And all fingers seem to be pointing at who as the trigger man? Clyde Barrow, now an innocent man's dead. P.J. Lane is not an actual person during the time. She's a combination of a lot of different reporters and the idea of the media during this time because the media played such a huge role in creating the idea of Bonnie and Clyde. I think it was really interesting that they made her a woman because it's a real counterpoint to Bonnie and the life that Bonnie's chosen and her path. What are you doing here? I'm just a fan. I think Bonnie has a real effect on PJ because Bonnie is extremely willful and independent. She sort of empowers my character early on in the story and in a very subtle way. Oh, I gotta say, I was surprised when I found out PJ was a woman. You always called yourself PJ? Or was that your boss's idea? And says to me, you know, look, times are changing. Amelia Earhart is about to across the Atlantic and I'm committing crime and you're writing about it. And she's sort of saying women are moving forward and, and she sort of challenges me. I couldn't help but notice. You only put Clyde's name down. PJ was a huge, I think, fan of Bonnie and Clyde until they start killing people. Once they started really murdering people, there's just really no way to get behind that. And then PJ feels partly responsible for creating them. How are you gonna perfume this, Miss Lane? And empowering that kind of behavior. And so that becomes complicated for her as a journalist. The thing that really interests me about playing PJ Lane is that she basically makes them Bonnie and Clyde with her role as a journalist. If I don't write this story, someone else will. We're still talking about them and making a movie about them to this day is all because of the media. 